Look at that guy. Big guy. That's a big guy. That's that's a large man. <laughs> What's he doing? What's he doing with that with that tail of his? It's just whop, pop, pop. He's a funny guy. Funny, funny guy. They call these things elephants. A little bit of uh, trivia for you. Big guy. They used to be fed. Oh my God! There's two of them. Uh, I I mean I uh, I hate to say it when when they're in earshot, but I could I could beat a giraffe. Look at that birdus. That guy chilling in the water, going in the shade. It's a hot day, but he's got a real funny funny nose, I, I might say. And I hope he doesn't take offense to that, but. I'm not sure birds have very good hearing, so, oh, oh my god, whoa, hungry, oh my goodness, <laughs> overall funny guy. I, I would think that sleeping next to the glass might be a little inconvenient, I feel like it would interfere with your dreams, but <laughs> maybe it's the equivalent of white noise, it's, it's really impossible to say. I can't say that I'm I'm a lion, so you know. But you know, I'll tell you this guy. This guy's a lion, and he's a, a lion. That's my uh, joke of the day. This guy is pecking. I don't know what he likes about the ground so much, but he's finding something very entertaining. I guess I guess this is like what they do for fun, maybe. I don't know. Up. Yeah, he he's finding. I, I think he made. <laughs> he's he's making sure each uh, each uh, blade of grass is up to his exquisite standards. I think that's the most likely explanation. Look at that guy! Oh my god! <laughs> he is posing. Oh my god! He 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 wants to be in that. He wants to be in National Geographic. <laughs> There's another incredible. Fish. This guy is swimming. He, he's looking straight at me. He's like, "Hey, there's a there's a hippo over there. Why uh, why are you filming me?" Oh my God, he's going towards the surface. He's going to evolve. He's he's becoming a land dwelling creature. There were more fish down here. They have not learned how to evolve yet. But this one, oh, you can see it breach water for a second. He is, he's figured out, oh, he's swimming right towards me. He sees the, the man on the other side of the glass. We're, ri we're witnessing evolution in, in a human zoo, the future of which is uncertain. Where we see a change in the very philosophy of life as we know it, uh, we will find out. Looky there. That's my favorite guy. That's my favorite guy they ever made. Oh, another emerges from the from the treetop. Oh, the, the doubler. And that guy's just chilling. He, you know, he does not have a care in the world right now. What, 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 what an awesome guy. Hoot hoot. Hoot hoot. Here, here we have some, some just normal cats. They, they, they just put some normal cats out here and thought nobody would notice. They try to differentiate by, them by calling them black footed, but I mean, many cats are, so. It's not that, not that special. If once wasn't enough, they decided to do it again. And this, this one appears to have just woken from its nap. Oh, it's hearing what I'm saying. It, it's curious, so I'll just say, yes, you are a normal cat. I hate to break the news to you. Obviously, it seems quite distressed. Yeah, they call you a sane cat just because you're tan. I, I know, try to, try to cope with that. I know it's difficult, but... Yeah, you're just a, you're just a normal cat. You're not, you're not supposed to be here. Run, get out while you still can. He, he seems pretty content. It seems to be always nap time for creatures at the zoo, but this one appears to have awoken as it sleeps on its um, care package. 
uh, trying to work up the courage again a little bit. I, I feel that, you know, in, in this society, really. All over here, we have the uh, Fennec Fox, very silly guy. One of the funniest, I, I dare say. He's up on a he's up on a ledge. I, I think he's scared to jump down, but here comes his best friend, uh, trying to convince him not to do it, not not to jump. You know, your life is worth saving and all that. He he looks he looks towards the audience for help as he as he decides to just kind of ignore the issue. Oh no, he's running. Okay, I, I know what he's doing at this point. And he's silly, but whatever he's doing, I, I promise you that much. I'm sure he can hear you. I'm sure. I'm sure. Shamooving. This guy, this guy's getting his workout in. He's not afraid to. Oh my! I can't even. I can't even follow him. He's so he's so pent up. Okay. Well, now he's nope. And here he comes back. Oh, 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 I guess I'll go back. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna leave forever. Up, oh, up, no, here I come back. Uh, running, running, entertaining, entertaining the audience. Okay, now he's gone. There he is, another, another sleeping guy. He's my second favorite guy they ever did make, probably. I don't know, he's up there. Uh, apparently there's another over there, but this, uh, this sleeping one's all that I can see. He's funny, I, I give him a silly out of 10. Do it, get up, I believe in you. Oh my goodness. Go, go. Gra grab, a, grab a rock or something. Push yourself forward, man. I believe in you. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh he's making movement. He's trying to grab on himself. He, he may be listening to my advice. Or not. <laughs> Look, I, I didn't, I didn't know. He, uh, he's not taking the uh, thinking man's approach. I don't think he's uh, much more trial and error with this one. But we, uh, it's time for another edition of Bird Central. Today we're looking at the most fascinating of birds, the uh, Tamar zebra finch. And though there may be a Komodo dragon, he's not really doing much. So. Bird o'clock it is. Look at this guy. He's hopping around. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Where's he going? He's. Oh, did he just fly? Uh, well, they're flying and not flying all the time. That guy's pulling a stick. Oh my God! Wow, the excitement. Another thrilling episode of Bird Central has come to its dramatic conclusion. He picks it up and and he's rather happy about it and he got it to the desired location, right there. Nope, nope, right there, Bird Central. So uh, right now we are at the manatee exhibit, and it's a pretty big place, lots of, lots of manatees. However, there are chairs that you can sit in so you can watch, but the chairs, well, they seem, they seem a little of ill taste, let's put it. <laughs> how, how gruesome. They're perceiving the universe while his friend is kind of chill and kind of getting in his way. Hop! He's hopping about too. He's, but he's just like, what are you doing, man? Come on, I'm having a moment. The guy's not letting him have any personal space. But, but now he's having a moment of its own. They're clearly very divided in their, in their friendship. They're roommates, but they don't, they don't quite see eye to eye. It's, it's kind of wacky and... They're, yeah, they're having a moment. They're they're starting to reconcile and you know <laughs> have a, have a leaf. You know. Yummy. And a final look at the giraffe, a beautiful creature. You see some of its friends in the background, but more importantly, it's uh, essential to remember that I could beat that guy up. <laughs>